Okay, we have our next fight. So good luck to uh, JellyPie13. Not going to give his real name out, but I'm pretty sure most of you can work it out fairly fast. But he's on my friends list. He's a great friend of mine, and he's a uh, uh, pretty fantastic anti-Russia. There we go. So uh, best of luck to him. Uh, pretty good hybrid as well, actually. We fought a few times. I mean, I'm not sure if any of us died to each other. I don't know what we're actually going for right now, so uh, we'll find out what happens, really. But that's defense mode, definitely due to laggy games. But yeah, this should be a fun fight. He has a Tokar Kalo, so that might be some bad news for me. Look at my health, you know, I'm always dead. Okay, I'm brewed, I'm brewed. Oh, if you didn't catch that freeze, that would have been good. But yeah, as you can see, I, I am kind of like a suicide hybrid. I prefer to brood for fun, keeping my health low and just enjoying myself, really, instead of having my health like a bazillion all the time, where the other person is just not going to kill me, really. But at this rate, I'm going to die because he hits every single time with his barrage. But if I get that on, I should be fine. And I believe he's going to attempt to fake me out. There we go, get those on. Got the defender off. No. Run away. And then let's just not do that. Because that's a bashing with the staff, man. If it just doesn't want me to wield my uh, other thing, really. Don't hit a 560. That will be painful, sir. So I'm going to switch to that. And hope to hell it will work. He's in his stuff. So, yep. Get a lot on. Oh, my days. My health is at zero again. Oh, my God. I get well scared. I just, I don't watch my health, like, ever. So I just, like, die all the time. He's trying to stack a hit. So that's good, you know. If I just go for it, I might kill him. I might kill him. I might kill him. Oh, that'd be good. He's well good at getting on his, um, what is it? He's a uh, rune armor in time, which makes it well difficult to beat this guy, to be honest. So, yeah. That's good. That's good. That's good. Oh, I keep, I click away and then I've got rune boots on now. Right, I'm just going to actually slowly click into those. And if we do that, then. I miss the switch every single time. It's just like. Rah, 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 rah. Sorry. That was unnecessary. Rah, 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 right there. Oh, Miss Clicked and he's going to come in with the DDS soon, I think. Caught a freeze. That's good. That's good. I think I can get to him in like a second. So if I go, if I can go. Okay, I don't want to camp because that's like kind of peasantish. Don't eat. Don't eat. Don't eat. Eat! Oh, God. Oh, right. Okay, I've got the potions left, but. I think I hold uh, quite a bit of food left, which is uh, pretty good. And yep, skeletons are coming in for a bit of a uh, painful damage, which I don't really want to think about. So come on, freeze. Yes, that was a good freeze there. That was a pretty great one there. All right, let's run over here and then let's do that. Easy barrage KO'd. I can't. No, don't bash him to the staff with the staff to death. That would suck quite badly. So let's go. Don't do that. I'm failing miserably at the end of this fight. That's just sucking right now. Don't catch a freeze. Good fight there, mate. Respect for deathmatch once again. Honestly, it's great when people DM me. And uh, one day I'll get some amazing clip where we're both like out of food. Well, I'm out of food. And then like pretty much um, we're both out of Well, I'm out of food anyway. And I'm staying until death. Never mind. No, I just comboed him out. One HP for the whole fight. Soul split doing work. It'll be a pretty great fight. Thank you for that scissoring to it. Back in a second, guys. I'm going to make sure I get those water rooms. Okay, we have our next fight, and then, oh, I actually think he splashed him in, and so I was going to just say then that I wasn't going to rush him, because I didn't want to rush into my hides at the start of the fight, but obviously that is completely irrelevant now, so my voice has completely changed there, I don't even know I can do that voice, but yeah, good luck to her, this guy fought him multiple times in the last episode, he can't get to me yet, he can get to me after this barrage I'm about to do, never mind, he wins this round for knowing timing better than me, so please, if I catch this, I will be a very, very happy Buddy! Right, okay, let's just get in there. Get a free hit in there. And then if we... Um, come on, come on, come on. There we go. That's what I needed. That is what I ripped. I took Soul Split off. I took Soul Split off. I took Soul Split off. What am I doing with my life? Right, okay. So I think I'm going to put these here. Because then if he switches to his hide, I'll just quickly switch to those. And probably uh, attempt to DDS him out. I'm not going to actually do that switch there. I'll do it now, actually. Oh, that would have been perfect timing as well. Right, okay. Uh, I'm not actually going to do it because I splashed, and that was the only reason I didn't do that. Not like I uh, didn't notice that I splashed or anything like that. Did I really just splash in for watch up? Please, can I catch a freeze now? Wow, 408. Not happy with that, but I am actually here, so Soul Split can do the work for me. I didn't actually expect him to switch at that time. <gasps> Go! 297. This guy tanks like every single DDS spec I actually put out on him. Go! 169. Not going to double spec because that's peasantish. Of course, his health's like a million, so yeah. Misclick those. Oh, Mystic Bottoms going on. And once again, when I miss a piece of armor, I catch an instant freeze. And it happens every single time. He's actually chilling there in his robes. I'm going to spec him now. That's good. That was good. Oh, he's dead as well. Good fight there, mate. That's like, we've fought like 100 times, really. But there we go. Finally, oh, I failed to switch on the end. I did I? I don't even know. Anyways, good fight there, mate. We fought multiple times. So, anything nice there. Quite a bit. I mean, another Staff of Light. That's pretty great there. So, I'll be taking all this. Very thank you very much. So, yeah, I'll be back in a second, guys, with another fight. 
Okay, so here I am, and uh, I've been in this fight for a good like three minutes now, so I deleted the first half of the clip because I couldn't really be bored waiting for it because you would have been all being bored. And we're not sure how this is actually going to end up, so I can get on him. No, I'm not going to do that yet, so this is going to be a really, really close one, depending on if I catch this freeze or not, which I did. Don't even have the defender on. It's going to be a really, really close one. Please, can I hit amazingly high? Okay, and uh, nice robes. Yes, that's exactly what I needed. And again, and again. No, that was the baddest, worst move I could have possibly done. Oh my god, that was so close. Okay, okay. Anyone in my area to kill me? That Captain Fun guy could, but I'm going to hope he didn't. But wow, that was bloody close. And yeah, I did actually cut out two minutes of the fight beforehand. But wow, that was a pretty damn close fight. Once again, thank you for the deathmatch there. Now, if he spam clicked me then with his DDS, I probably would have died to him. So I'm ready to teleport if that guy PJs me. I really hope he doesn't, because I don't want to lose my kills. Get out of it! Oh my god. Tree! Okay, so I just died, but... My recorder obviously didn't record audio, so just quickly throwing in here that I died. It was an unlucky death, like, as you know, I don't really safe in hybrid fights, and I uh, rely on soul split, and then I was low HP, and he barraged me, and he didn't have soul split, so I didn't, I was looking for the, um, soul split animation to know when to eat and stuff, but, uh, he didn't have soul split, so obviously I got barrage KO'd, yes! Okay, we have our next fight. Fortunately, that last hybrid clip didn't go well. Like, I just, like, uh, added in that little, like, extra bit of a commentary there. Assuming I hit, like, a 732 then, he may have died, but he didn't. So, um, currently I'm in World 18, so I may be lagging a bit. He's dead! Oh, of course a zero. I mean, if that wasn't a zero, that would have been just a beautiful clip, but nope. So I do need to be a bit careful here, because, obviously, with lag, I can't, like, time things amazingly well. Plus, being in World 18 as well, the words uh, amazing amount of rushes come to mind. So, yeah, if my health is uh, too low at any time, a rush is, like, Oh my god. Low health, low health. Roar! One XP drop. That is just what every rusher is. I, 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 I barely die to rushes these days, to be honest. So, okay, so I need to get back into this fight. So I'm going to go for a, a nice uh, deal on combat. I don't really think I can get an armor takeoff because. Not in World 18. By the time I actually manage to take my armor off, I will probably be dead. Oh wow. Okay, I expected to die then because. Um, Hit pretty high in his range, but I didn't want to use my bruise, so I just kind of protected that really. Oh, that could have been amazing. That was decent. I'm going to do two because he's only going to eat once. Oh, 400. Wow. Maybe rock brood. Okay, so I'm still avenged. So if I go for another one now, please turn around and hit me. Yeah. Slightly higher. I don't want to bat him. So uh, ring of recall needs to be put on. That would be okay. That is not good. That's good, though, because he ran away and he didn't return. I've got no... Um, What's the word? I've got no uh, brew now to stay alive with, so uh, I may be dead, like, now. I just literally just looked at my health bar and expecting it just to go to zero, so. Um, got no specs either, so I think I've actually got one spec looming. Oh, wow, as if you'd hit a zero at that point. That means I'm still venged, which means if he hits huge now. As I do hate! Oh, that's just ruined it now. <laughs> I just completely killed Oh, no, 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 I'm still going here, still going. Let's go. Uh, let's just de-long spec him, because if it hits huge, he's dead. 32. Oh, I didn't expect. Risk it, risk it, risk it, risk it. You can't poke that. Oh, man. Oh, right. We have to be closer. This is going to be a pretty close fight. I do have a teleport. That's good. Um, I, oh, my days. I'm not even protecting it. I'm very smart. I thought I was back on there like World 1, 2, 4, then or something like that. So, 4, 1, 9. Definitely going to be there because poison hit, venge hit, everything hit. Which is my luck, right? Okay, so now it's time to just keep rock brewing. Keep, oh, sorry, just keep rock tailing it up, really. So, this guy's out. So, this may be an extremely close fight. I'm on a zero kill streak, so I may as well deathmatch him. So, I'm probably going to lose, though. Soul Split does tend to uh, always beat me towards the end. It's going to be deadly close. Now. I think I've got it, though. Come on. It's like a staking video here. Respect for the death match there. Good fight. Respect for the death match as well. Did he just eat them? I swear his health just rose. So thank you there for the death match. Definitely appreciate it. And this is on World 18 as well. A death match on World 18. Don't hear that every day, do you? But yeah, good fight there, mate. And I shall be back in a second with another. Okay, we've got our next fight, so good luck to a uh, known threat, gonna get the uh, first hit in there, is that the guy I just fought? I think it was, but I'm not 100% sure, yeah it was, I'll give him the good fight, smiley face, and because I typed in a fight, expecting Norman just to come back and be dead on the ground, it's not only what happens, so, I'm not gonna put Raph up at this point, because if I do, then he shall Raph me back, and I shall be dead, wow! That was close, good fight there, mate, that was a great bench combo from me, but wow, I almost killed myself in the, um... In the, uh, the same, like, time there, so let's uh, quickly uh, take this uh, rune set home with me. I'll be back in a second, guys, with another fight. Okay, we have our next fight, so good luck to this. I just need to wait for the right moment. Hopefully, I won't get Venge comboed out. That would be a bad sign, but I just feel like I'm lagging, like, ridiculously. I don't know why, but why is this guy keep running through the fight? He's just like, oh, no, go, let's run this way. Oh, you know what? I'm actually, I'm not too happy. I'm going to run through again. He just did it. Now I'm dead. Oh, God, what was that? Okay, we have our next fight. Fortunately, that last fight, the D-Fire, 
came out of nowhere and blew my head off, really, so that didn't go fantastically well. So good luck to uh, this guy, really. I've got a uh, rather a strange setup at the moment, and I'm probably going to be dead with this strange setup in a moment, because this guy's whip doesn't really like taking breaks upon uh, dealing damage to people, so uh, I've actually not got a Dragon 2 under on me at the moment. I'm not sure why, but maybe we're just going to go for some nice DDS hits, which we are currently going for. Unless I die now, 106. We'll do one more. I'm not going to double specs. That's peasantish. Yeah, that is what we need. My DDS actually hit for once. Good fight there, mate. Oh, Where's the Abyssal Wave? I wanted to steal it. That's some good damage there. Yeah, good fight there, and then hopefully we can find ourselves in another fight, and hopefully I will not be dead instantly. Okay, we have our next fight. Once again, someone with an Abyssal Whip. However, this guy does not actually have a Defender, so hopefully, actually, yeah, yeah. So hopefully I'll be able to uh, maybe not just get absolutely uh, destroyed, really, in this uh, fight. So um, could go for a little cheeky DDS at the start. Don't know if he's got a Karasu, though. Uh, plus seven, potentially. Most people don't seem to. Every now and then you meet the odd peasant that just has a crossy like, oh, I've got a crossy, I'm going to use it because it doesn't ever hit zero. But yeah, I mean, overall, I mean, it doesn't happen often, so a nice spec now. Like, if that was a 300 XP drop, this guy's life would have expired. This guy is a safer. So therefore, we have to sit back and wait patiently for some damage to be done. And first of all, a ring of recoil being on would be a fantastic place to start. Oh no, revenge. I am extreme. Oh my god, it's a G Mall! Yes, that was so close. Right, let's just go quick eating, quick eating. I'm not even going to move until I've got my health on full. Saw that coming. That was pretty close there. Pretty sick risk from you there, mate, as well there. But yeah, thank you for that cement on a stick. I'll be back in a second, guys. To the bank! Okay, I'm not too sure how this is going to go, but I'm fighting a guy in full void. So depending on his defense level, which is probably going to be like a bazillion, really. I may not actually hit a thing overall, but... Uh, Coming into the Void perspective, his damage should be huge, which means I should be able to get some fairly nice uh, Venge combos, I hope. However, in the same boat, I can also be dropped off 601 HP due to a Dragon Fire! Oh, wait. Anyone in the world would expect at least 50 damage there and killed him. But no, it's me. So therefore, I hit a zero. That was the... You can't get a more perfect Venge. I Venged his D-Fire, for God's sake. And he survived. So yeah, I'm going to keep chomping. I'm not sure what he can max on me. I mean, if he's probably around 440, he could probably hit. So pretty much what I have to do is just tank this guy for the entire fight until I rebuild the Venge and hopefully just get a decent Venge combo on him there, which I can hopefully claim his life with. But yeah, as you can see, I'm not hitting much. Which means he must have, like, 70 or so defense. Right, this is going to get a bit painful now, I'm thinking. So maybe I should Venge. I can't tell if he's specking me, so... Don't even hit a 362. <laughs> That's close. Oh, right, okay. Um, he's going for it again, so that wouldn't be too bad. Don't hit like a 500. Yeah! Just make sure I survive. That's pretty much what I had to wait for there. Just avenge the uh, thing. So there's a plant nearby me, so I'm pretty sure I might just get PJ'd in the next three seconds. So hopefully I won't be. Yeah, give me those two Phoenix X's right there. I'll have the snakeskin boots as well. People seem to complain about people not taking snakeskin boots. So I'll be back in a second, guys, with another Batal. If I can find the right glory on me, Batal. Okay, we have our next fight. So hopefully the uh, power of the cow's crossbow can cause a quick and early painful death towards this guy. But anyways, um, that'll do actually. You know what, if he hits Hughes on my Venge now, I'm a halberd. Actually learnt to hit, he would have been dead. But yeah, I've still got a Venge on, which is uh, pretty great. So if I hit him now, maybe like a 200. Or just, did I hit him? I can't even tell, he just didn't even do anything, but yeah, okay, some high hits would be great. You know what, I'm going to go with the DDS now, because if it hits huge, then he might die. Yeah! Good call, I drink a range potion. Did anyone see me click that range potion? I don't know, World 18 just has to lag me out quite a bit. But yeah, good fight to you there, mate. And my kill streak is slowly climbing back up. I don't know why I'm range PKing without my cement on a stick yet, but just having some fun, really, and hopefully I will be able to kill some people. So yeah, I'll be back in a second, guys, with another battle. Okay, we have our next fight. Good luck to this guy with the Obsidian Shield of Death. So this may not go well. But I do, to be honest, I always say that every Obsidian. And then, to be honest, I actually probably win more than I lose in the Obsidian uh, the Obsidian Shield uh, fight type of thing. So I'm not liking the look of the 104. Can't PJ me, so I am uh, quite fine. Cannot PJ my enemy either. So hopefully we'll be able to get a, a nice combo in there. I'm going to eat now because I, I don't really want to die. I don't, I'm not on the highest kill streak, but I'm, you know, I'm in the... Uh, the growth stage of my uh, kill streaks, really. So hopefully I'll be able to um, earn a decent amount of. I don't know what I'm talking about right now. What, where was I? Uh, something to do with uh, my kill streak slowly rising, really. So yeah, currently I'm hitting zero every single time. I don't want to put the Phoenix X on there. Pfft, it's a peasant right now. Oh, that was like a perfect hit there. But the Venge is going to hit me. Two nine four. Boom! Seven hundred and thirty-two XP with the DDA. Never happened though. And hello there, Clora. What the hell? 
What the hell? Who are you? Who are you, sir? I recommend you take a trip down to the McGregor's farm, McGregor's Woodcut place in Camelot. Because you probably gained some good levels in that. So gonna stay there for the rest of your life, mate. And you might find a decent amount of trees to cut down. You know, that would have been so god, I should have brewed. But I didn't. Venge, 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 venge. Go on. No. So, I, you know what? I think it would have 1 HP. I think I would have put him on about 1 HP then. So I'm pretty happy that my venge did not actually activate then. I'm not sure why I did it then. But yeah, maybe I'll get some nice DDS spec in there. The legs are off. The legs are off. Yeah! That's what you get for a quick chat in there, mate. Good fight there. Nice DDS spec there. And I shall be taking my wasn't I'm nice, but yeah. You know what I mean? So keep the, the outro short. I always do like drag it on a bit. I'll be back in a second, guys, with another battle. Okay, we've got our next fight, so good luck to this person. Pre-Circulate! Let's go. That's a pretty sweet name, to be honest. I like how it just is said, really. But there we go. There is our nice bench couple of doof! Right, he's dropped a shark, so therefore the words Armadou God Sword are about to be pulled out right now. Okay, so I did just kind of waste a brew there, but had he pulled the God Sword out, then I would have known that he had a God Sword. So it was a bit of, um, what would the word be here? If I DDS now, then... Oh, the Just fine. Pretty close one, on. That's a strange reaction from me, I'm not sure, but yeah. And my DDS been a bit higher then, that would have been a very, very nice clip there, so. Okay, so now we just have to try and um, stack a nice little cheeky halberd on top of this guy's berserk helmet, causing his life to end abruptly. See, if that was like a 268, would have been dead. Whoa, get those on, he ain't getting a free hit on me. Not a lot. He hit my Venge off, didn't he? So, that's that gone, but... Right, he's Venge now, so as soon as I hit like a decent XP drop, I will go for it. Go! Oh, 27. I can't. The World 18 ping makes it so difficult to time things, but my health is... That was good, that. That's good, that. <laughs> no, recoil. Oh, man. Why did I eat? <sighs> I just had to think, like, I could... Spend, I mean, I can't really say, oh, if only that was, like, 10 XP higher, because if only his GMOL spec was 10 XP higher, I'd be dead right now, so I guess it's just whoever gets the first, like, not really lucky hit, but the first time to get a decent hit, and that's a decent time. Yes, yes. Halberd, what are you doing, sir? You know, I think a Dragon Halberd spec is in order. I think, hopefully, if we get the uh, the right time. That's good, that's good, that's good. No, because I'm dead. I'm dead. Did it even hit? I can't tell what's happening right now. Oh, this world is so laggy. It's just, like, horrible. Right, okay, 366. I'm going to eat there. I don't want to I don't want to suicide. Like I said, my uh, kill streaks are doing uh, quite well at the moment, so I don't want to, like, completely ruin, like, the world. Like, okay, and then I'll just take my bolt racks off. That is completely fine. That was a good hit as well. That was a fantastic hit. That is it. That is it. That was it. Oh, there we go. Dragon Halberd, you have now earned a spot in my mansion, sir. So when I get a mansion, I'm 99 construction, so I should have a mansion. Give me that cement on a stick. Right, back in second guys with another fight. I believe I actually have my cement on a stick now, so let's go and uh, give that a um, little bash in the wilderness. It's going to be taking all these potions home with me, though, because they are very useful in the uh, academical worlds of RuneScape. That made sense. Okay, let me just quickly fix this uh, screen as I attack this guy in the face. Good luck, sir. So good luck to um, this guy over here. So he's raffing already, so I don't really like him much. So he does actually need to go and crawl into some pit of scorpions and hopefully burn himself. But yeah. <gasps> what the hell just happened? I just died. I was doing well good as well. Just as I helped to the non plus Just as I get my G-Mall as well. Why does this game hate me? I don't even care. I'm getting this loot back. Oh. Okay, we have our next fight. Fortunately... Getting so close to the end of the series, I just keep on dying at like the worst situations ever. So I really should have got my fury out and done some risk fighting at that point. But with the um, well, with what happened, really, I think uh, I may have died with the fury. I mean, that would not have been uh, great. But yeah, I'm not really running the highest kill streaks at the moment because I am um, because I'm so close to the end of the series. I want to try and like get some risk fights in at the very end just to like complete the series on a great note, really. But I do need to get the kill streak to get there, first of all. You, sir. Okay, I'm not even going to go to him. I think he died earlier on this episode to me. I'm not sure. Did he kill me? I can't remember. You are the worst rusher in the world. Look, you can't even kill a guy for a ring of life. Just go and find yourself... Oh, don't get me started. <laughs> don't get me started on rushes, really. So, and let me just get back into this uh, fight, really. So, gonna go for a nice uh, takeoff switch here. So, oh god, that was a little sneaky one by him. So, 380. I don't think you can hit that. Not with a ring kite shield and a D skin, but however, I can hit. What? <gasps> why am I doubles back in? I don't know why I'm doubles back in. Gonna eat there, though. Don't wanna hit a 308. I do take risks. But I'm not, like, suicidal on my risks. If that, like, doesn't really make sense at all. Yes, that is fantastic. That was perfectly timed. That was beautiful. I am happy with that. I am... Not even, don't, <laughs> I'm pretty happy with that. You know that full rune set back in the day? That was two, that was worth 200k right there. But yeah, I'll be back in a second, guys, with another fight.
Rangers, how I love Rangers. I really hate them, but I still fight them. To be honest, I actually only started fighting right there. Okay, so, yep, there we go. There's your second bench, so now I've got to spend the whole fight. Oh, my days. Oh, my days. Another death like that. I clicked those rock tails. You saw me click them. You saw me click the bench. You saw me click everything. And I died. That didn't go well. Hate Rangers, they exist everywhere. Just like that guy there. Okay, we have our next fight. Unfortunately, some ranger decided it'd be very cool just to walk in and be like, Oh, hey there, Bertie. Let's uh, just quickly attack you for no reason and drop your vengeance. That is completely fine. So if I had the vengeance, this guy may have been a pile of rocks on the floor right now. Which obviously forms rock shell, which obviously I will take. And I shall be using that later on for when I actually die again. Because I'm obviously going to die again because my hits are currently in like, I don't know, they're in hibernation or something. I mean, I can't hit at all. But now that I've said that, I'm probably going to hit loads. And everyone's going to be like, God, he's always complaining. I'll be like, come on, so Yo, that's good, that's good, that's good. And there uh, was the hell I was waiting for. So my house, look, he has a granite mall. And I know that for a fact. So therefore, I'm going to chomp on one quite cheekily there, so he's gonna like maul me if it hits high, so I do need to be pretty careful about this time, but this is probably my death. Yes, success survival right there. Right, okay, here we go. Let's uh, get a... There we go. Did I... I always miss the plate body. Why do I always miss the plate body? Why is his health at a bazillion... Oh, my days. Oh, my days. Why did I put it back on? No, that would have been sick. And the world is cruel. Very cool. There you are, little peasant dropping my vengeance. Oh, Look at him. Look at him there in his gorilla mask, thinking he's a gorilla. Pfft. My health is quite low now, but if I... Re oh my god, I clicked in between the rock tails. I'm so unlucky. Okay, here we go. This is this is it. This is the moment to shine. No, it's not. So we're going to put that back on. Hit without the defender. And we hit high, of course. Why do we hit high? Because my life is cruel. Please don't hit a 266. Oh my god. Oh, that was bloody close. I think I just went to 1 HP there, but I have no idea. But wow, that was bloody close. Give me that dragon's 2 HP. Alright guys, looking a bit like he's going to rush me there. So if I quickly chomp onto 781 health, he cannot anymore kill me. But anyways, uh, good fight to you there, mate. That was a pretty intense little ending there. And that's just revenge for you killing me earlier on. So I'm back in a second, guys, with a new the fight. Bank. Okay, we have our next fight, and this guy's actually risking quite a bit of money, but he also has max gear, so that is why this uh, fight may be a bit scary, so if we go for a nice DDS on the Venge, never mind it. He's got a tortoise, just sort your life out, that's all I'm going to say, but yeah, um, he's probably got like an armored of Godhood along with that rapier hidden with him, so I do need to watch out for that, because uh, he pulls that out, if it's like a 460 with his rapier and pulls an armored of Godhood out, I'm dead pretty much, like, let's see, oh, it's a Kerrick Maul, I can deal with that quite easily, he's got a... G What's his spec weapon going to be, do you think? Probably a G Maul, yeah. So I'm, if I expect a G Maul, I mean, that's probably the most scary spec weapon I'm up, I go up against. So if it is a G Maul, then um, hopefully I'll be able to tank it quite well. But yeah, if I just keep on chopping while his rapier does damage, he doesn't even have a defender on. His, damage, his rapier is just murdering me, but yeah. So uh, I'm ready on my spec as soon as I actually manage to hit, that is. I mean, I bet you, like, like that, every time when I have to eat, I always hit. And I'm going to hit, what, 50 zeros in a row? Never mind, I'm not going to hit 50 zeros in a row. But I'm going to DDS double zero, that's good. I don't need to. I've got no defender on now. So now what happens in this fight? This happens! Okay, I'm still venged. Oh, I'm still venged. I'm pretty sure I'm still venged anyway, so I may actually be able to kill him quite easily. Come on. Right, you know what? I'm gonna spec now, because if I am venged, he's dead! Oh, that is what I'm talking about. I was waiting for that. Good fight there, mate. Anyways, I'll be back in a second. In another fight. Yes, Elite Black. I am wearing this stuff because it now matches what I have on. Yeah, back in a second, guys. Ooh, smack that stick. Okay, I died. Yeah. Okay, we have our next fight. So good luck to this peasant right here. 104 combat against me. So normally, when I get into fights with people who are higher combat, pretty much they just like win most of the time. I mean, the main reason I fight these people are just like more of a uh, challenge, really. So I'll quickly say now I am rendering at the same time. So I'm good. <laughs> what well, I was trying to say was I'm rendering at the same time, so I might die. Okay, this is like round 17 bazillion between me and him, and if I don't catch a freeze now, I've automatically lost this fight, but yeah. Um, okay, so the clip that we just watched, we are not going to, we're gonna focus on that tree, that scorpion right now, actually, that's a good one. We're gonna look at it, just walking around that tree like a happy scorpion, and now it's coming to PJ me, so we are not going to focus on, please can someone take the scorpion off me, I would much appreciate it. Please get the highs on. No, 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 not again, not again. I will refuse to have that again, okay? Right, 
Yes, Boss Maroon, that is my day completed right now. Come on, we just have to pretend that it didn't happen. And a catch would be fantastic right now. Now that I've switched, he's going to catch an instant freeze. And I'm going to get a loading screen, which isn't very good. But yeah, if I do it now, that's bad timing to do it, to be honest. Because now he's called a freeze on me. I don't want to DDS him in his highs. Because I'll hit double zero, no my luck. But yeah, okay. And then he's hit a very nice, tasty freeze right now. Do not de skim spec. So I de skim spec expected. Oh, <laughs> this guy just is like working with Jagex right now just to have everything go against me. Like, everything is going wrong. Right, okay, now if he catches a freeze, now that's good. That is good. That is fantastic. That is really good. That's really good. My misclicks on. 2 6 1. That is how we get a rematch. Good fight there, mate. 1 1. And that is what you get for having a Scorpion come and try and PJ me there. Good fight to you there, mate. And I should be back, guys, in a second with a another fight. Closing in on seven kills left. They'll probably be mainly hybrid kills. Hopefully, I can get some fantastic ones back in a second. Okay, we have our next fight, so good luck to uh, this peasant over here. So once I get my auto-freeze on him, we shall be letting my auto-freeze pro.xe do the work for me while I sit back and relax while it does a hybriding fight for me. He switched a bit early, hasn't he? Oh, well, he switched back then. Pretty funny, that when you like, say you get in a hybrid fight and they froze you and then sat back for like, <laughs> like 10 hits just trying to get close to you and as soon as they did, you just like switch again and be like, hey, see you later, mate, and then it'd be like, pretty harsh, but oh well, okay, so if I got a decent, if I got a decent XP drop, oh, no, 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 that's bad, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad, that's good though, because I'm going to catch this freeze, no, <gasps> no, I didn't catch it, why didn't I catch it, I do not know why, is this guy like 30 defense, no, he has that 40 defense helmet on, so, he must have the defense level necessary for the, um, what am I talking about, okay, so let's get in here, zero, nope, get hides back on, let's do that, and then let's do that, ha <laughs> you didn't see nothing coming, <gasps> Sorry, that was a bit unnecessary to be honest, but yeah, okay, so I'm uh, doing some uh, quite a bit of damage this fight So right triple mega ultra five misclicks at once leads to doing that pull the DDS there and instinct catch Let's not talk about it. Let's just think about <sighs> Unicorns having a tea party. No one can hate on that, right? Well, I can hate on these splashes that are coming out right now. Auto freeze pro. What are you doing? Okay, so I'll have to stop being a bit of a peasant right now. Oh, what's my... There we go. That's how I fix my inventory. That is good. That is good. That is good. That is good. That is fantastical. That was the worst clip ever. Okay, we have our next fight. So good luck to this guy. And this fight probably will not go well because the only way I can really like kill people in a hybriding fight is by specking them out on the highs. But because this guy has defense, I'm probably just not even going to be able to hit his highs. Well, not, not highs, sorry. Robes, that's what I meant to say. Whoa, 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 my inventory just messed up then. Okay, please, a freeze now would be great. Am I frozen as well? No, I'm not, which means if I go for it now, which I can't because it froze me. Oh, that's because I don't even have my hides on because I'm an extremely good hybrid, but, <laughs> oh God. Right, okay, yeah, but pulling my fighting defenses, I'm just, I probably have like a 0.1% chance of killing this guy. So if I do kill him, I'm pretty happy, but I am kind of just wasting my time fighting this guy overall because... It's just gonna be splash after splash really on these things, and then when I get him, when I actually get a good time to spec, I'll probably just zero zero him. But we'll see what happens really. I mean, I've got a decent chance, I guess. So, Volpa scroll, boom. See what I mean? See what I mean? That was the time I needed right there. So, no, don't do that. Skeleton, go away, please. Now he'll catch a freeze. Oh, okay, he didn't catch a freeze, but the skeleton needs to go away, or I can't kill him. I think he can actually get away from me now. No, I'm going to go through with that switch. That messes me up so often when I pull the item and then, like, it takes, like, a month just to go back into the slot it was meant to be in where then I can actually do something with it. So, can I switch now? I think I actually can. So, if I get a decent switch... No, 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 because he'll, he'll have his armor on by the time I get to him. Okay, just ignore this all happened, really. So, oh, oh, oh that would have been such a good time as well. He didn't, he didn't catch a freeze. He didn't catch a freeze. He didn't catch a freeze! <gasps> 307! That is exactly what I need. It's such a horrendous clip. But, mm, decent loot as well. That's not bad. But yeah, the only way I can actually kill those is by specking. Oh, God, he had a chronic mole. That probably would have cleaned me out there. But at least I killed him. So I'm pretty happy with that one. So actually, I will admit right now, I did not expect to kill him. I don't expect to kill anyone with defense. But I need to get all these potions so people don't screech at me. But yeah, I'll be back in a second with another fight. 
Okay, we have our next fight, so good luck to this guy. Yes, he splashed exactly where I wanted him to. Double check that I'm actually on the strength mode, that is good. As long as I'm on strength mode when I do that switch, I'm completely fine with it. But I'm just, again, really just gets me, but, oh, man. Okay, there we go, got a freeze in there. I mean, he's going to go for a DDS soon, I believe. So if I get a, uh, my D-skim ready for some damage, maybe I'll be able to uh, take him out. If he doesn't, uh, watch his health bar. No, never mind. Oh, my God, I wasn't even watching my life. <laughs> I was I oh man, I didn't go well. Kill this guy now, because this will be a really bad clip, but yep. Yeah, it's gonna run off for about a mile before I can actually attack the guy. So here we go, get the helmet on. No, of course I can't get the helmet on, because it takes a week before I can actually do things on this world. So let's run over here. Right, okay, let's do that. No, he's not switching, so we're just gonna freeze him with the defender on, I guess. Cannot click at all right now. Oh, oh is he death matching me? Please don't death match me. It'll be such a bad clip. But we'll see what happens. Oh no, no, don't waste a spec if he's still here. He's not out yet, I don't think. I mean, I might die at the end of this. Come on, freeze. It's going to be so close. I think he's only on Soul Spit right now, so I'm just going to wield those three, really, and get in there. Yeah. Good fight there, mate. Dab defense is about a bazillion. I cannot actually DDS him out. I don't know why, but I've DDS him out 500 times on his hides, and every single one's below like 100 XP drop. Alright, Soul Spit's not going to heal me now. I'm going to die if I ain't careful. Don't want to die to him. That is unallowed. I'm not allowed to die to a raise, and, uh, don't think I can ever sign on Skype again with um, Carl on there, so that'll do nicely. Let's hit that, and then we're going to go in on... No, we're not, because he's in those, so we're going to freeze him in the dehyde body. We're going to splash. Not good. Okay, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. 500 foot. No! Here we go. This is going to be just, like, amazing. Like, as soon as it comes from me now, I'm going to go for it, but... Need to get the correct spec in at the spec time. Sorry, not at the spec time. At the correct time. Who the hell are you? Can he attack me? No, he cannot. That means I cannot get ragged. However, this has... Oh, Barrage KO'd! <laughs> That's right there. Abyssal Whip. Thank you. Thank you for that. Cha ching Okay, we have our next fight. So this looks a bit like a Rag Ranger, to be honest. I'm not sure if he's, like, potentially properly PKing, because he's on a bit of a peasantified gear. But if we risk this, then he hits my Venge and my DD. <laughs> that was good. That was a good uh, attempt. Oh, what? That's not fair. Oh, well, it was pretty lame kill anyway. I didn't use the uh, Sanfu, so let's do that. My po my sh attack potion is quite enough there, so that'll do. Zero with the uh, D Twitch right there, but yeah, I don't really want to die that often towards the end of the series, so let's do that and then let's take my armor off and hope for a big. Oh no, he's DDS in me! <laughs> that went well. Okay, we have our next fight, and I am currently still for the past like hour and a half, two kills of freaking end in this series, and I can't get them, and I don't know why. I'm having the worst specs, I'm on dying all the time. I've probably cut out a few deaths, I'll probably leave, there's probably some text that said that really, but I did actually cut a few deaths out, because I actually cut a few kills out as well, because I didn't want to have some pretty lame kills, and then obviously there were really good kills as well, like perfect venge times and all this, and I should have recorded them, but I didn't, because I am practically Dr. Peasant right here, so things are just not going well, so I could use a nice like 500 XP drop right now, which would have made a decent kill to the end of this, but seriously, I need to have some good kills for my past two ones, I'm really hoping I get them. To be honest, if there's a guy like about to deathmatch me, I think I might just teleport out because I don't want to have someone DM me at the end of the series. It has to be a huge spec or some incredibly good loot. And not me dying again, please just brew. Please brew. That was a really good Venge timing for him right there. And he's actually on my friends list, so now he's dead because my Venge was coming out. An armor takeoff, that is what I need on here. So I want to move over here so I don't click on this guy over here. Just have this lucky tree here. And there's a lucky scorpion there as well. But yeah, he's got the timing right. So I'm going to let him have a free hit on me. There we go. And that was the worst free hit ever because now I have to jump on some food, which is not good but yeah a perfect timing would be if i can hit him now and now he hits me perfectly come on that is pretty good that's pretty good that's perfect come on here we go three two one we're gonna get this one we're gonna no event no i can't even press f1 pressing f1 then he won't let me it's pressing the like escape key or something like that oh well, okay i'm not sure why i took it off there but maybe we'll get the hero 169 not bad oh man he has zero on me ah, i would have been the best clip of it, it would have been good actually i would have been happy with it so we're gonna get this armor take off now no we are not I can't click properly. I don't know why. I'm moving the mouse around so that I can click properly. Let's do that. Why does this guy feel the need to have to stand right there? Right where I click my fight. He stands there. What a peasant. Who the hell uses Sarah Strike as well? Risk it. Get rough on. Go! Oh, that would have been amazing. Even if I died, that would have been a sick kill, to be honest. Look where he stands. Right, I'm turning my screen here. This guy even knows exactly where I'm looking at something. If he moves to there now, I will not be happy. Go on, risk it. Risk it. Yeah! Got him. Decent kill there, but now we are one. Did he deathmatch me? Right, he did deathmatch me. Thank God. He was going for a nice risk there, and I got a little cheeky D-skim slice in there. So, yeah, good fight there to Trying Team. I don't even know his real-life name. I've forgotten it. 
trying to think here, but it doesn't need to be said. He knows who he is, really, but yeah. Pretty sure his name is Albert. I'm going to guess it's that. But yeah, I'll be get back in a second, guys, with the final fight of the series, which I hope will be a good one. But like I said, I cannot choose what I hit. Spy on rock, cut tree. Okay, here we go. Potentially the final fight of the series. Find a guy called X-Fuse. Hopefully we can get some nice hits in here. Hopefully a nice combo. Whatever the hell. I hope this is a good click, really, because I don't want to ruin my series with some... Amateur clip at the end, really, so let's just uh, keep my health high, and let's just make sure I survive my face, really. So if I don't survive my face, I am officially dead, so maybe he'll randomly hit me. Yes, that was amazing. Who the hell is a one, right? Auto-retaliate, do the work? Never mind, he decided to eat 15 times in a row, which failed my auto-retaliate, but uh, oh my god, I'm hitting so well. So this DDS back has just claimed the end, and it's a zero. I expected. Expected Patronum, as we do. Right, okay, so I'm actually hitting really often on this guy. And I don't want to spec right now, because it would have been a horrible... Why did I brew then? <laughs> Hopefully he will spec me. Oh, he's going for one as well. Yes! That clicking was beautiful! 171! That was nice. There we go there, mate. You give me that dragon skimmer And as you can see there, the final achievement of the series has been completed with a fairly decent kill, to be honest. I mean, I was expecting to have some guy deathmatch me, and then that would have just been like a three-minute fight, and it would have been boring as hell, but that was... Probably not the best clip I could have hoped for, but a definitely a good one. So thank you for watching, guys, and let's give this a proper Okay, option. guys, uh, I'd like to say, just to end this clip, thank you for watching the uh, 10 mil new challenge, depending if you've seen every episode or if you've just clicked onto the final one and just watched everything spoiled. But, of course, this is the final episode to the series, and I've now actually completed it. I'll have to say I definitely had quite a lot of fun making this one. Could have been better if I didn't die in certain places, as my kill streak was getting close to the 25 quite a bit, and then obviously I died to some uh, way, but overall, like I always say, I can't choose what the wilderness does. I think I've done a great job in this series, so the only thing left to do on this series is to sell the final tabs. As you can see, I've accumulated 61 whips, an armadillo godsword and a bandos godsword. They may have been the wrong way around, but it doesn't matter. So I'm going to go and sell my entire 10 mil nuke series, my, yeah, my 10 mil nuke challenge tab, find out the ending price, show you all the ending statistics, and then end the series. So I'll quickly just sell everything, and we'll see where we go. Okay, so I've sold pretty much the entire tab. I've left some stuff in there, but I actually sold some stuff that I'd PK with. But when I say that I've left some stuff, you'll understand why it's there. And some of it wouldn't sell, so I didn't bother selling it. So final cash pile is 80 million if I have pressurized anywhere near 81. Almost pretty much 81 mil there for the final cash pile. And if I just go back into the uh, tab, then as you can see, there's pretty much nothing there. But the potions were up to a good, like, extra 4 mil or so from that. And then everything else. I mean, some of this stuff isn't 10 mil new challenge stuff, as you can probably guess. But there we go, guys. That is the series for you. So I do hope you've enjoyed the series to the max. And as for the outro, I'll probably throw in the links to, like, the earlier episodes. No, I won't actually. Just if you want to watch the whole series, there's a playlist actually on my series to watch the whole thing. But that's sort of like a good 5 hours plus. But yeah, overall, I do hope you've enjoyed this series to the max. And it will be great to return to just basic Edgeville PK commentaries. As for PK series, I have nothing in mind, so it'll probably be those for quite a while. Anyways, I hope you're enjoying your May. This is probably uploaded while I'm still doing exams, so I've probably not actually spoke to anyone properly in a while. So yeah, do hope you've enjoyed the series, guys. Just gonna leave throughout shows that. Hope you enjoyed this video as well. The longest PK commentary I've ever made. It took quite a long time to create this video, but yeah, it wasn't great at that point, but I decided to cut out some deaths just to make the video better as the overall thing. But yeah, like I said, once again, hope you enjoyed the series, guys, and I'll see you in the next PK commentary. Peace!